If you want to transfer files from your MetaQuest to your phones, it's simple. You can download the app and you can get it done. However, when it comes to large files, or generally when it comes to transferring files, it's a hassle because if you want to sync this media from using the MetaQuest app on your phone, it might take longer. And if you want to transfer large files that are above one gigabyte, you would not be able to transfer those files at all. I'll give you one example of that. So here is a file that's greater than one gigabyte. Now, when I go ahead and try to transfer this file, you would see it says it's a video that's over one gigabyte. It's too large to sync and it cannot be done, right? So I can either share it directly on Facebook or Messenger. I don't want to do that. I just want it on my phone. So it's a very, very easy way to do that. And in this video, I'll show you how to transfer these large files from your MetaQuest to your phones without the need of a computer. You can directly do it from your MetaQuest to your phones. And let's go ahead and quickly learn how to do that. So first of all, for this, we need to go to our phone and download an app that's called VLC Player. Let's go to my phone and quickly download the app. So on your phone, you would need to go to either App Store or Play Store and search for VLC. When you type VLC, you'd see VLC Player. Look for this icon, this orange icon, VLC Media Player. That's the app that you need to download and install. I've already downloaded it, so I'm just going to quickly open it up. When you open it up, you would see these five tabs on the bottom of your screen. You would need to go to the network tab. Under the network tab, you would see this option sharing via Wi-Fi. Now, when you would enable this option, you would see an address that is going to appear that starts usually with 192. But remember this address because you're going to then need this address on your Meta device. So either write it down on a piece of paper or maybe just type it, send it to you via WhatsApp. The point is you need to remember this address when you're on your Quest device because you need to type this, this address on the browser in your Quest device. After you do this, just keep it open. Remember, don't close the app. Just keep the app open and stay on this page. And then now we're going to go back to the Meta device and then type this address and then send files or transfer files from a meta device to our phones. After completing all of those steps on the phone, what you need to do is you need to open up the browser on your MetaQuest device and then type in that URL. We'd go ahead and search for it. When you do that, again, remember to keep the app open and phone unlocked. You would see this option here. This is the same file just to show you that I've already transferred it, but I'm gonna show you how to, how to do that. It's very easy. Once you're on this page, there's a plus button on the top right corner. Just click on the plus button, it's going to start showing your media. This is the file that's one larger than one gigabyte that I've just transferred already. I'm going to transfer this one as well just to show you. By the way, you can only transfer one file at one time. Select the file that you want to transfer and then just tap select. It starts transferring right here. As you guys can see, it's at 4%. It's going to take literally one to two minutes and the file would be transferred to your phone. Let's just wait for it to transfer and then I'll also show you how you can transfer this file from the VLC app to your gallery, how you can save this file in your gallery. You and now that we've transferred the file to our phone, it appears under the video section. So right here, this is the file that we've just downloaded. If you click on it, it'll, start op it'll open up and start playing. You need to also now transfer this file from within the VLC app to your gallery. And it's very easy to do so. Just long press this video and tap on the share option. After you tap on the share option, you would get this save video button. Just tap on the share video button, it start appearing in your gallery. Let's go to our gallery and see. So this is the file that we've just transferred. You guys can see the quality looks fantastic. Everything works just fine. That's it folks. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and we'll catch you in the next one. Thank you, bye-bye.